G'day, welcome to Two Minute Tips uh, on location here at Fulbury Park on a Thursday night. Obviously you'll be watching this on the Friday. Uh, with me here is uh, Andre Klein, the Otago Racing Club Chief Executive. We're going to have a wee look at Wingatui on Saturday, obviously the biggest meeting of the year, Champions Day. Uh, Andre, as always, big fields. First I'll try and just keep it to two minutes. Yes, we have got big fields um, for the last couple of years. This meeting has attracted the highest number of starters in New Zealand. That's something we're really proud of and I'm pretty sure we'll be quite close to that this year again. So, yeah, delighted with the horses that we've attracted um, to the meeting. Excellent. Uh, we'll go quickly go through the three, uh, three features. Um, go to straight to the main race, the White Robe Lodge. Uh, one in particular standing out there for you? Well, look, I think it, 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 they're all really competitive races. Um, obviously, there's some really nice horses in the race. The the top three for me is an Alpha to me was a Valley and Sucre and uh, El Chico. And El Chico, a sprinters. That's it. So, but I think stepping over a mile might be a big call for those horses. They're very talented. One that has a great record at the distance is Ridley. He has been running over 1,200 and 2,000 and 1,200 and 2,000. But his record at a mile is bang on and he's been going quite well at those distances so I'll bang Ridley on top, local horse and I'd love to see him win. Yep, no fair enough and uh, Joanne does a good good job, good strike rate and uh, trained on the course yeah. so that'll be a big help. Absolutely. I'll uh, quickly jump to the Dunedin Guineas, uh, my question for you is can they beat Bel Mirage? Big fan of the Effarages, um, I think very difficult to beat but possible, and I know you did disagree with me on this one, I still like Quira, his runs prior to the Gorgonies were really, really strong, and it was a terrible ride, I have to say it, um, and Signify, who you know went off with him like a cut cat on that occasion, since come out and wins, uh, won rather, so uh, Bel Mirage is definitely my top pick, wouldn't mind Quira each way perhaps, and probably good each way odds now I think after what happened to Gore. Fair enough, won't be on my Cornella ticket, but that's, uh, that's what that's racing right. is for, you know? difference of opinion gold cup as well uh, andre uh gold cup now that is the trickiest race yep. out of those features i really think um i'm a massive alpine heights fan he did disappoint me a bit at trentham though i watched both his races and i had high hopes that he'd go really well but he didn't go as well as i thought run a bit flat the second start and, and a big race um so this race is open to probably a, a young and up and coming kind of stare there's the likes of all willie um who are who like as well and um i did mark blue and gold uh, Brian Anderson's horse, uh, that's got some great owners in that, including the old secretary of the Tiger Racing Club, John Rosevier. Each way chance, blue and gold perhaps. I mean, he's, 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 rated, he's only rated 80, but why not? Gets him quite well. He does get quite well yeah. with the weights, yep. yeah. Excellent, that's just a little bit of atmosphere noise there with the, the uh, water truck going past. Uh, thanks for your time, Andre. We'll Pleasure. just quickly mention as well, of course, we've got uh, uh, Brian Anderson's uh, pace, actually New Year's Jay going around at Addington tomorrow night in the Group 2. Uh, you also got Jack Adjusty in the Group 3 and um, punch, Al Reza. Can I just mention the puncher of the year competition yes, at Winger 2 as well. If you fancy a chance as a punter, you'd certainly be better than myself and Matt. Come along to Winger 2 on Saturday, we have got the Otago Puncher of the Year. It's a free to enter competition. Uh, there's an individual and a team uh, version of the, uh, of the activity. So get involved, a lot of fun. Excellent. Well, there's uh, a little bit of extra spruiking from Andre. So that's uh, four and a half minute tips for, again for this week. But uh, we'll catch you next time. And if you are around the um, Wingatui area, head along to the races on Saturday.